Okay, so it's June 16th of 2022, and this is the highway construction around Golden. Uh, this section of highway has been one of the worst in Canada for years and years, and they're finally straightening out the last uh, bit of it that goes around the edge of the mountains. And uh, we're going westbound. We just have finished the stuff they're driving piles here for uh, some new widening of this section of the road and they've got several other parts up ahead here that uh, just boggle your mind what they're trying to do here uh, so as we climb up the hill here uh, the portion that you may be able to see just in the distance above the concrete rail there uh, they're going to try to straighten that out and there's multiple places where they're building bridges to cross a little gap and then cutting into the mountain to straighten out the areas where they have to go around the edge of the mountain. These cranes are sitting up on platforms that have been built in and they've driven piles down and where are uh, not these ones but the, the, where some of them are are just downright scary they've driven uh, put them uh, right over thin air with big long piles driven down uh, sometimes the upper end piles you could see about 15 20 feet of piling and then the lower end the slope is so steep that you've got 50 or 60 feet of piling before it gets back into the ground and here's one kind of dead straight ahead here this crane that's nearest us is sitting out on a platform and it is just like that crane driver deserves danger pay he's on a platform that if that platform collapsed he'd be uh, a thousand feet down before he knew it so here's where they're going to build a bridge across and straighten out this little curve that we're dipping into the mountain uh, each time we get to a point where we go around the edge of the mountain, they're going to cut into the mountain and uh, widen this road. And right where we are, we think the road is going to go lower here because off to my left, uh, it looks like the roadbed is down about 30 feet or 40 feet below us here. So we believe they're going to actually take the road a little bit lower. They're doing lots of construction down there that we just can't see from here. So there's another crane that looks like it's uh, doing some pile driving or uh, able to do some pile driving. Here in front of us, you get another look at all of the equipment here. They've been working on this for, I think, approximately two years now, uh, but only over the last year have they really gotten into serious construction. So just down below us on the left there, you can I can see some new roadbed from the driver's seat, but you may not see it. Yeah, you can. And uh, again, that's where we're dipping into the mountain, but instead we're going straight across. Now, see straight in front of us here, a big gap in the rock. That used to be mountain. They blew that out of there over the last year. They've hauled out probably thousands of truckloads of, of rock out of there, and that's where the road is going to be going. It's just going to go straight through the gap there. We had... Uh, Many years ago, a terrible fatal accident happened right on this corner in front of us here where a pipe uh, it ran into a bus carrying students and uh, there were some fatalities. So here's another one where I can actually see a concrete abutment there that a bridge is going to uh, go on top of. And uh, this little thing where we've gone into the mountain, we're going to be going straight across and then... Uh, so that is another interesting little thing. Maybe one part of the road going there and the other part going off to our right where they've cut into the rock. Or, I don't know. 
it's going to be very interesting to see this materialized over the next couple of years as they finish the construction. We've driven this section of highway for about the last 18 years quite frequently as we uh, travel between our home in Calgary and our summer home out in the uh, Shuswap Lake area and this section has always been very slow and very dangerous. Truckers have to go through here at really slow speeds because the corners are so sharp and uh, going up and down. Here's a here's major construction. This is even significantly changed from about five, six days ago. We didn't uh, see much of that and uh, we're coming not too far from the end of it where we're going to be joining a road that was newly constructed about five years ago and uh, so we're just down a few more corners here lots and lots and lots of equipment out here and it'll be wonderful to get all of this finished make the road and a lot quicker to travel and here we are at the end of that stretch and we're joining the highway that was built about five years ago as a part of uh, phases one and two of this multi-year this is this whole project's been going on for over a decade to straighten that one little stretch of road so hope you found that interesting <laughs>